This is Time and Again, a podcast series for LACMA, the Los Angeles County Museum of Art. I am Maz Jobrani, and this series is inspired by the exhibition In the Fields of Empty Days, the Intersection of Past and Present in Iranian Art. Though Iran is often in the news, for most Americans it is little understood. We have asked a group of experts on Iranian culture, academics, curators, filmmakers, and artists to open a door for us into Iran. What is Iran? Every single Iranian you will speak to will give you a different answer in terms of what is Iran. It's a very special, very personal relationship. Not surprisingly, they each ended up focusing on poetry. There isn't an Iranian who doesn't have poetry on the tip of their tongue because they grew up steeped in it. In the years that I've been away from Iran, especially past years, I have this crazy amount of poetry that comes to my head almost every day. So at the end, I think I could say Iran for me is a lot about poetry. I think that Iranian people are survivors, and much of the reason they survived the tough time um, has been um, in their relationship to allegorical language and to poetic language. And when I say poetry, the main one that comes up is the epic Shahnameh. It was written 1,000 years ago and serves as the cultural and moral backbone of Iran. Many of the artworks in this exhibition are inspired by it. The Shahnameh is full of extraordinary stories with unexpected heroes. It's an incredibly important poem in Persian culture, and it has some of the same power as the Iliad and the Odyssey of Homer does within uh, Greek culture and world culture as well. That's LACMA curator Linda Kamaroff. Linda is the woman behind the exhibition that inspired this podcast, and she will join me throughout the series. She will help us understand the ongoing significance of the Shahnameh and how artists continue to be inspired by it. Join me and Linda and a few of our friends for time and again. To learn more, visit lacma.org slash podcasts, and to listen, go to iTunes or wherever you get your podcasts. Thank you.